a beautiful day turned into a super evening. News 13 Chief Meteorologist Ted Pester is here now with your first forecast. Ted. Super D duper, as my buddy Barney would say. I guess he's my buddy. Outside tonight, it's cool, but not real cold. Uh, mostly clear skies. Uh, it's going to be a little warmer come New Year's down there on the Strip, you bet. 46 now, 36 in the morning, 57, and then 63 as we go through the afternoon, which is above normal. Full forecast for the weekend coming up. Mark, Kathy. Well, let's check in with Ted Texter, who's here now to give us all the good news for the weekend and uh, into the new year, right? What, what's all important? good news? Yes. What's important is that the weather's just going to be beautiful. And just continuing somewhat on that theme, uh, I mentioned Barney, but the bear in the big blue house is really kind of my favorite. You know he has and, little children. And that came home. from... Uh, out of left field. Yes, it did. But uh, Kathy's kids are just a little bit, a so little bit older. too old. You kind of missed out on the bear. And, I did. Uh, he is a hoot, as I, they say sure in the south. Is. Yes. Now here in the southwest, uh -huh. the weather's going to be a real hoot too. That that's a good thing. That's a good thing. That means that it's going to be fun. Uh, 47 now. It's cooling off, but not really getting cold. In Salt Lake City at 19 degrees, and Denver's only at 20, at least it's 20 above. We've got some cold air just to the north and to the east of us, but here at home, fairly mild. 43 now, down a little bit. West breeze is blowing. Humidity is up, relatively speaking, because of the cooler air. And the barometer has been rising throughout the evening time. Big trouble in the southeast where they say, they say things like that, hoot and whatnot. That means fun or funny. Down in the southeast, the storm is beginning to move offshore, but still there is a lot of cold air swinging in, replacing it. Upper Midwestern United States, see that curl? Wow, that curl is making some snow. Uh, from uh, Minneapolis down to Chicago, on farther to the east, to the south and to the east, it's continuing to churn it out. These things could merge somewhat on the east coast of the United States, and as that occurs, this occurs. The low develops a little more fully into a front and more snow will likely develop. Keeping in mind that the air is going around the low like this, it draws moisture in off of the Atlantic, throws it back into cold air and you get snow. Sometimes a little bit of ice is a possibility too. Across the west, we're seeing snow well east of us, but not here at home. 62 is our high today and 36 is where we started this morning. Tomorrow we go to 63, I think, at the airport. Henderson about the same, Boulder City running about 60. Tonight, down to 36 degrees, chilly but not cold. Throughout the afternoon tomorrow, 63, high temperature, mostly sunny. 35 for the low in the seven-day planning forecast. You know, we, we try to bring you useful information here, and this is very useful. It'll only get a little bit cooler as we go into the beginning of next week. And I think that even adults, I know I enjoy watching The Bear in the Big Blue House. Yes. More so than Barney, i got to say. Well, I'm happy for you, Ted. Okay. That's good. Okay. I'm a Blue's Clues fan myself. Oh, they're yeah. good, too. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Thanks, Ted. Mm -hmm.